So uh, we got this uh, pressure washer in and the pressure washer initially showed up because it was leaking water uh, according to the owner the tires were severely flat but put some air on those there's tubes in them which is kind of surprising but uh, replace this o-ring here uh, after I got it back together cleaned up the carburetor and got it running uh, hooked it up to some water and uh, noticed there was a leak in the wand as well uh, the de severely deteriorated uh, rubber o-ring so replaced that one and then got her to chooch and there was no uh, no pressure so the next uh, place that I went to look because there's no sight glass in this was uh, tilt it back and look for oil. Probably should have done that to begin with, but usually don't see a whole lot of pumps coming with without any oil. So uh, pulled the uh, brass plug out and shores poo. The oil was like down in here. Uh, thankfully, I have a good neighbor that had some SAE 30 oil laying around and changed that out and filled it up and uh, <clears throat> and the nice thing about these these pumps sometimes is that in order to get them to chooch you have to release the pressure in the wand Valve sounds like it's just doing its job, but um, I think uh, instead of spending the 200 bucks on a horizontal pump, uh, pretty sure I saved um, this individual some money, and uh, I'll change the oil in the uh, in the crankcase just as a nicety before I actually deliver it, and uh, thankfully it wasn't a bad pump. So, uh, these are good units. I mean, uh, I've had a couple 2750s. Matter of fact, the neighbor over there, I sold him a 2750 a couple years ago. And uh, actually, ended up, he ended up storing it in the, uh, the shed. And he didn't release all the water from it. He left the hose up to it, which is a big no-no. And uh, cracked out the pump on this side. So I ended up replacing that with a Comet pump form, but uh, initially I tried to replace it with a uh, with a cheapo Amazon uh, pump, and that turned into a, a big failure. So uh, today we'll go back to hanging out with the Mad Elf, and we had a good windstorm the other day that blew my signs signs down and my scissors and blew the tarp off the boat. Well, and uh, the uh, Cub Kid will be up for sale soon. I have to uh, buy a new deck belt for that. Well, but otherwise, it, it runs and starts. There's just two of the projects that I was working on today.